Hey, it's Dr. Centeno, and a lot of our CCI patients have other areas that cause problems, right? They may have upper back pain or leg pain or low back pain. And that's going to really fall into two categories, and it's important to understand this. One category is that when they treat their upper neck or uh, they put a collar on or something is done to take the upper neck out of the equation, that distant pain or symptom goes away. So for example, they might get upper cervical chiropractic and the right leg issue uh, gets better. Or they might get uh, upper cervical chiropractic or use a cervical collar and the numbness down the right arm gets better or their upper back or low back pain gets better. In that case, then we're not going to treat those areas, right? We're going to focus treatment on the upper neck because that's the driving factor. Now, sometimes those issues develop a life of their own. So the low back becomes problematic in and of itself. The upper back becomes problematic in and of itself. And that needs to be treated. In those cases, when they get their upper neck treated, it doesn't really seem to affect those other parts and pieces. Um, and in those cases, we need to do some imaging of those specific areas, let's say it's the lower back or the upper back, and decide how that's going to be treated because that's going to be a separate treatment from treating the upper neck. So hopefully this helps in figuring out, is this coming from my upper neck or do I need those other areas treated as well along with my upper neck? Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Hey, get this out to more patients by like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks so much.